Hey loves, my name is Gabriella and welcome to my channel and if you're new here I just want to go ahead and say welcome and thank you so much for clicking on this video today and this tutorial I'm going to do my current go-to makeup look so please go ahead and give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and hit that notification bell for alerts on my new upload. Now let's go ahead and get right into the tutorial. So first things first, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a piece of regular old scotch tape and I'm going to place it from my lower lash line to the end of my eyebrow. And I do this because I want my eyeshadow to be very crisp and to have that nice crisp line, especially when I start smoking out my eyeliner later. So for the eyes, I'm going to use the Anastasia Beverly Hills Soft Glam Palette. And I'm going to start off by putting the shade Orange Soda into my crease as a transition shade. And I just wanted to let you guys know that I did do my brows off camera before I started this video because I am going to be having a current updated brow routine video on my channel very soon so be on the lookout for that guys so from the same palette i'm going to use the shades sienna and rustic and i'm going to put it in a v in the outer corner of my eye and i'm going to take a fluffier brush and i'm going to blend it out now I'm gonna go ahead and just cut my crease um, just about three quarters into my eye and I'm going to go ahead and use my e.l.f. Complete Coverage Concealer in the shade Light. take the shades glistening and fairy and I'm going to apply it right on top of the concealer that we just cut our crease with now I'm just gonna take my previous blending brushes that I used for my crease and I'm going to just blend out those harsh lines that we might have created with the fairy and glistening shade that we applied on top of that concealer just a minute ago May fall in love again if I stay too long What we did last night Oh, it was amazing If I gave you the rest of my life Now I'm going to take the shades Cypress Umber and Noir from the palette and I'm going to go ahead and create that outer V again with those two colors Oh my mom I tried but I can't stop thinking about you and I'm just taking uh, another blending brush and I'm just gonna start blending it out and diffusing the product into the crease. Feel like I know you forever Can't believe that you just met me I got hella shit to do today I'm just hoping you don't let me in I'm So I'm gonna take the Maybelline Gel Liner in the shade Blackest Black and I'm gonna go ahead and apply this to my top lash line and create an outer wing Keep it on repeat like my Jones I'm ready for breakfast to bed I'm ready for another round and it's okay if you do this part a little messy on the wing and don't get the wing, you know, how you want it because we're just going to be smoking it out here in a minute with some shadow and then 
that's what the tape's also for. So you can make a big mess. <laughs> Now I'm going to go ahead and take a flat angled brush and the shade Noir from the palette and I'm going to smoke out that gel liner. And now I'm just going to go back in with a blending brush and blend out any harsh lines again and make sure everything is cohesive. For all day. And after this step, I just went ahead and applied my mascara and false lashes off camera. So for foundation, I'm using the Huda Beauty Faux Filter Foundation in the shade Latte and the L'Oreal True Match in the shade Sun Beige and then I also mixed in with this foundation some of the L'Oreal Paris Lumi Glotion in the shade Light Glow. And for cream contour, I'm going to use the Too Faced foundation stick in the shade Cappuccino. And I'm pretty much going to put it where I would contour. So my cheekbones, my temples, um, my jawline, and down the sides of my nose. No, it ain't sweet. I forgetting all the friction when we have a little smoke will make you a believer. I've always tried to say. I'm going to use my Maybelline Age Rewind Concealer in the shade Light Medium. And I'm just placing it under my eyes, down the bridge of my nose, in the middle of my forehead, on my chin, and on my cupid's bow. So pretty much everywhere. Give me one conversation. I can be soft, you can be the places that I applied um, the concealer with a Maybelline Fit Me Translucent Face Powder. And for the rest of the face, I'm going to use this Maybelline Fit Me Loose Powder in the shade Light Medium. And now for bronzer slash contour, I'm using the Hula Bronzer from Benefit Cosmetics. Yeah, it was all good. Until you my son still here. Now 
gonna take a fluffy contour brush and I'm gonna blend out that contour. palette I'm going to use the shades orange soda and burnt orange on the lower lash line and I'm going to take the same gel liner and I'm going to apply it to the outer parts of my lower lash line I'm going to blend it out with the shade Noir from the palette. So I do not remember where I purchased this bronzer from because the label rubbed off of it. But if I do remember, I will put it in the description box. And any bronzer, illuminating bronzer, should do the same exact thing as my bronzer. Um, and I'm just gonna go ahead and pretty much put it everywhere. So I wasn't kidding when I said that I was gonna put it absolutely everywhere. <laughs> And I just took some mascara and applied it to my lower lashes. And for lips, I'm going to start with lining my lips out um, with a Jordana Cosmetics lip liner in the shade Mocha. Lipstick, I'm going to use the L'Oreal Paris in shade Pink Cashmere. Now for my favorite part, the lip gloss. I'm going to use the NYX Butter Gloss in the shade Vanilla Cream Pie. For my last step, I'm going to take the Pixi Rose Glow Mist and I'm going to go ahead and set my face. And that's going to go ahead and complete this look guys. I really hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. just wanted to let you guys know that I will be doing videos of me actually sitting down talking to the camera really soon. I just got to get my setup together first. So until then, see you soon. You get me so high, you get me so high.